Welcome to Open House. Right now I'm coming to you from a chic apartment in New York's Flatiron District that combines classic elegance with stylish contemporary living. From the richly detailed foyer, you drift into this impressive great room. It's a warm and welcoming space that includes an open kitchen. High ceilings keep things airy and large picture windows frame the historic neighborhood beautifully while letting in plenty of natural light. Three bedrooms are kept separate for privacy, including a luxurious master suite. In all, the home is well over 2,500 square feet of gracious modern living. We are getting started with an architectural gem in Pasadena, California. This unique hexagonal shaped mid-century modern home was built in the early 60s by architect Roland Russell. This one-of-a-kind home offers nearly 3,000 square feet of light-filled California living. Welcome to 1450 El Mirador in beautiful Pasadena, California. I'm Ivan Estrada and I'm super excited to show you this beautiful mid-century modern built in the 1960s and just recently renovated to the 21st century with the best in design and technology. So let's go on inside and check it out. This unique residence was designed by architect Roland Russell. So if you don't know who that is, Google him. It's kind of a big deal. Almost every aspect of this updated abode, from the roof, to the cabinets, to the pool, are all six-sided, so you know it's gonna be a very interesting tour. So as soon as you walk in, you're really hit with that wow factor with this Japanese cedar surrounded by this wooden deck, which is virtually visible from almost every room in the entire house. So no matter how negative the world may be, you could come into the space, open up the three sliding doors, just meditate, let nature in, your body's just filled with gratitude, and that's why this space is so special. This is my favorite space. You have terrazzo flooring, and then your eyes caught by that beautiful pewter fireplace in the center of the room. And in Los Angeles, it's so warm, you don't need a fireplace, but with a sexy fireplace like this, I would turn it on almost every day. This home was made for entertaining. I could just picture some swanky Hollywood type pouring themselves a drink at this gorgeous brass wet bar, which would probably be a Moscow Mule because that was a thing back in the 60s. Now let me tell you a little secret. Brown Meggs, who used to live in this house, signed the Beatles to Capitol Records. Rumor has it that he first listened to their record in this very living room. Pretty cool, right? If the living room is the 60s, check out this kitchen, which is definitely of this century, with top of the line tech, cleverly designed, and just super sexy. Everything techy is hidden away. As you can see, there are no interruption in the clean lines. You got your hideaway plugs. Check out these self-healing cabinets. Thanks to the use of nanotechnologies, they thermally heal any micro scratches. Even better, this material stands out for its anti-fingerprint feature and is soft to the touch. And honestly, who doesn't like to show off from time to time? I mean, you've got a towel heater in your kitchen. Who needs a towel heater in their kitchen? You do, because you've got a pool. Follow me. Following the unique theme of this home, this pool has six sides. The hexagonal shape will definitely be the talk of any summer soiree. And don't forget the 10-person integrated hot tub adorned with hand-painted tiles. Let's go on inside. I've saved my favorite room for last because it's the most unique space in the entire home. Now be careful you bring in here, you're not gonna wanna leave. Check this out, you have your master bedroom with this ultra comfy modern style bed set and the natural light pouring through the glass windows and sliding doors gives you that quintessential LA outdoor indoor feeling. And adjacent to the master, the bathroom features hand painted tiles, cathedral ceilings and heated floors for those delicate toes. Don't forget the walkthrough shower that leads to the second atrium, complete with an outdoor spa-like jacuzzi tub, complemented by warm tones and open air. After you've cleared your mind in your private getaway, head on over to the library for a good book or your favorite story before dozing off to bed. Hope you enjoyed this tour of 1450 El Mirador, definitely one of the most unique mid-century moderns on the market. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you at the next property.